This is getting ridiculous. I'm going to end up in an ambulance if this carries on. This girl is absolutely nuts. Say. George, Aaron and Katie, you are off to meet the next ep. The tablet of terror goes off again. Oh, this thing does my head in, man. I feel like throwing it in the sea. A bit nervous, to be fair. I don't know which X is going to come out of the water. Oh, for fuck's sake. You're not going to believe this one. Guess what her name is? She's called Dominika. She's Polish. And she's also 21. And to top it off, she's mad as a box of frogs. I came here to see where we're standing at, because obviously, like, it just ended. Was it just like a shack? I come into the villa, I just wanted to have that one-to-one -one conversation with him to find out what actually went on between us and if he was actually serious about the relationship or was it just a fling? I enjoy spending time with you and that, obviously. I was get, getting to know you, but it was just a shag to me, to be honest. The reason I've pied you off, because you're a fucking nutter, man. Oh, am I? The thing with me and um, the new Dom, I was just getting a bit bored of it and she's a bit loopy and I just found her a bit strange. I said a few things I didn't mean. Get rid of some of your cats, he's fucking weird. <laughs> <laughs> the tablet of terror went off and sent me and Aaron on a date. I started by apologising because I felt I was a little bit out of line on the beach. Think I owe you an apology. Don't really think you're a psycho. Aaron was on a date with another Dominica. I was a bit anxious about what's going on on the date, but I did believe that he hasn't done anything. So, um, that Dominique girl? Somehow, I don't know, like, I've sort of got roped into being Villa official. The more the date goes on, I start, we start having a bit of a laugh, having a bit of a flirt, give a bum a cheeky slap. Nice. Couldn't help myself, like, literally, her ass is by far the best ass in the villa. It looked banging in the outfit she was wearing. So it turns out the tablet of terror's gone off, and shown everybody a video of me slapping the new Dom's bum. Nice. Oh! Hi! Oh. Not very nice. The next thing, Aaron comes in with his new Dominica. Everyone, this is Dominica. Dominica <laughs> two! That's Dominica one, you're Dominica two. Nice to meet you. Right, sit down. We came back to the villa, people were asking us about. Uh, the date, how it went. I could see Dominica giving me a weird look. I'm looking at Dominica and I, she's got that crazy look in her eyes where she smells like this. So I was like, okay, something seems a bit strange here. The question uh, came up about Aaron slapping me on the bottom. No, he's smacking up an arse. No, no, it went like, it went like that. After denying a couple of times that he slapped her ass, I told him that he deserves a kiss. Oh my God, I think that you deserve a kiss for that. Yeah, go on, go. Go on, give him a kiss. Go on, give him a kiss. Give him a kiss. I just came over, grabbed a huge piece of cake and threw it at him. Sorry, babe, you really deserved it. I'm too good to be treated like this. Fuck! <laughs> So the cake hits my hand and it just splatters everywhere. I've got cake in my hair. This poor Dominica bird has done nothing wrong. She's covered in cake. It went all over me and it was just a massive shock. Like, I wasn't expecting that. It was just out of order for me because I don't think she should have reacted like that. As far as I'm concerned, if she wants to react like that, yeah, over a slap on the ass, then the girl's a psycho. He acted really wrong towards me. It was disrespectful and he lied to me. He broke my trust. I'm sorry, but these things are really hard to repair. 